Hey y'all, it's Taylor from Tattoo Teacher Plans. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing my September monthly and I have this really cute kit from Lexi Kylie Designs. I have only used her one time before and it was for a weekly kit. So I'm excited to try out her monthly format. I think I'm gonna like it. So let me show you what I got. Um, this is the September monthly, like I said. It's a September Harvest EC Main Kit. So we have the labels that go across the top couple of flags, a strip, and then these are to cover the days that are not in the month. By the way, I apologize for my voice. I am sick and hopefully I'm on the other side of it, but sorry, it's still like lingering. Um, these boxes are for the other days that are not in the month. We've got some boxes, some payday stickers. We've got some holidays here, a little bit of deco. Those are really cute little flags and some date dots. And I love the black accents in this kit. It's really cute. And then we've got the box add-on. I wanted to make sure I had enough boxes and then I added on the decorative sidebar, which is really cute. So that is the kit I'm using. Now let me show you August because I am pretty much finished with this spread. It turned out really cute. I really like this, but these pages are proving to be not so useful for me. I'm gonna try it one more time, and if it doesn't really work for me, meaning I'm not going back to it, then I think I'm going to tape these together and just use this page for my monthly tending list. Oh, I just, I want it to work, I really do. It just isn't really speaking to me right now. I like it, I just, I never come back to it. It's not useful, so. One more shot and then next month I may tape those together. So I've got some things on my list to do and I am gonna set up this page. I have some washi that I'm going to include. Let me grab that real quick. So I've got these. I thought that they matched with the kit really well. So the top one is like this green plaid. It's kind of hard to see. And then black and white, burlap, and some uh, black. So that's what I'm going to be working with this week. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and get started on the base of the kit. So that means I'm going to lay down the covers at the top, the days that are not in the month, and the sidebar sticker, along with paydays and the date dots. And then I'll be back with you to work on the actual like day-to-day -day plans. So that's what I'm gonna go do right now, and then I'll be back.
Okay, now that the base is down, I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna use some washi and I might even use some of these boxes or maybe these guys or something. And I'm going to set up my notes pages. So let's do that. All right, here's what I have so far for my notes pages. So I have my monthly to-dos or my attending list over here. I used some Happy Planner stickers and some washi. I'm gonna put a quote here for the month and then I will put in my monthly goals here. And then I don't know, I still don't know what to do with this. But um, if you have ideas, leave those down in the description for me because I am at a loss on these pages really uh, I was really excited about them when I first got the planner and then now I just don't have enough to fill up the space if that makes sense so um let's go back to this page and let's get into the daily plans so let's start with the first and I have my EC folio my dailies and I have my um, monthly calendar right here. I'm gonna put that up here for me to see easily. I need something to weigh it down. There we go. All right, let's get started on the day to day. So I've got this left, I've got this left, and I've got all my boxes. All right, let's jump in. So the first, nothing. Labor Day, um, <laughs> let's see. I do have things on my calendar, but it's like video ideas and stuff. So if I'm skipping, it's not because I don't have something. It's just like I don't put it in this planner. I do have something on Friday, though. This is my grandmother's birthday, so I do want to put that in. I think I will use... I have two birthdays this month, so let's just use this for her birthday. And then this is also... Or this day is ruffles and rust, which is like my favorite thing. It's like a traveling trade show thing. And I think I'll just use like a, just a box. And then I will find something cute to use with this. So they come seasonally. And there is a store in town that's also like for ruffles and rust. But it's like fun 
Um, I'm looking for my fall stickers right now. So it's just fun stuff. It's like crafty stuff. It's just really cool stuff that is unique. And I love unique things in my house and clothes and all that stuff. So I love going to that and I will be going to it. Let me use one of these pumpkin paper co girls. My cat is making a ruckus in the background. If you hear that, um, these are more Christmassy. Hold on one sec. Okay. I'm back. Um, she was being crazy. These are more Christmassy. I need to put these with my Christmas ones, but for now, I'm going to slip this back in here. Um, here we go. Okay, so this is more like red buffalo clad, but these are so cute. I think I will use one of these. Although I do have some new paper pumpkin co girls. I've got these and these. Let's see if one of these works. These are more like spring, summer. But these, these are also summery. Although it's not like summer. Well, it's not fall here. It's still like super hot. So maybe I could get away with one of these. Um, how about this one? That will work. So I'm gonna put her right there. I am going with a friend. And then on the eighth is grandparents a day. I do want to call my grandparents, but I think that sticker is enough for that. Um, the 10th, I have a Blue Apron coming. I have taken a little break from Blue Apron, because mainly because I couldn't cook with one hand. But now, I can. I'm not like fully, like 100% back, but I am on my way to being healed being healed, um, being better. I will never be what I once was. <laughs> I have come to that realization, but you know, at this day and age in my life, it just is what it is. And I'm not getting any younger <laughs> and I will not bounce back no matter how hard I try. Um, I'm just going to use a piece of Leftover deco from an old kit to mark blue apron. Like that. Okay. And then we got Patriot Day. And then on the 13th is Payday. Okay, I thought I had a lot going on this week, but or this month, but apparently not. Um, the 16th, I have a dentist appointment. Yay. I really don't like going to the dentist. You know, I have some cute. Fox and Pip stickers that have like a tooth on them. I can use that right here from the Bow Basics page. So we can do that on, I feel like I can use this box. It's not gonna take up the whole day, but I might go and get my windshield replaced this day too. I'm still thinking on that. I'm going to try to do it sometime this month. Um, and then this day we have a school board meeting, so I do need a half box for that. Let's use a cute box. Um, maybe this one. Oh, well, you know what? The 12th also. Let me go back to the 12th. This is going to be our first... Um, planner club meeting at school. So I had a student approach me and she already like figured out that I have a like planning Instagram and channel and stuff. And like I mentioned it in passing like one time and she remembered it and she figured out everything about it, which, you know, I was kind of annoyed at first, but like, what am I going to do about it? It is what it is. Um, and she's one of my favorite kids, so we are starting a planning club for students, and I think it's going to be fun. Um, the 18th is my best friend's birthday, so this is school board meeting that I do have to attend. I don't always put them in my planner, but if I do, it's because I have to present something. So that is for my best friend's birthday. I feel like I should do something 
a little more than that. Um, I don't know. I'll think on it. And then the 20th is homecoming. And I do have to work the dance. So I want to put that in. This is also the day that the Downton Abbey movie comes out. And I do want to mark that as well. So I think I'll use like a skinny label like this. Or Downton Abbey. I do want to go see it. But I don't know if I... Um, I'm definitely not going to see it on the 20th. It just comes out on the 20th because I have to work that dance. But I, I want to probably go on the 21st. Okay, what else? Um, okay, the next thing is the 28th. I have a baby shower. My friend Jennifer is having a baby. And my mom is making my gift. Hopefully it's ready in time. If it's not, that's totally fine. I can just like tell her what it is and I'm sure she'll be cool with it. We're also having a baby shower at school for her because all the kids wanted to come to her baby shower. So I don't know when that is. We haven't exactly set the date for that one. Also, this day is the date that I think my cousin and I and another friend are going to go see Legally Blonde. They have a, um, we have a theater here and um, they're doing Legally Blonde. So I think we're going to go on the 12th. That's when we've kind of decided that we're going to buy tickets. So let me move the planning club up a little bit. I need a, like a skinny label. Or I could just put in a planner. Let's do that. Planning. You know, for being a planner, I don't have that many planning stickers. Let's just use one of these guys. Um, and just the black one. Like that. Okay. And then that's our baby shower. I feel like I want to do something special for that, but I don't know what. Um... Ooh, okay, maybe Fox and Pip has something baby related on here. I just don't have baby related stickers because I don't have a baby. Um, and all of the mom stickers that I get on samplers and stuff, I just give to my sister. So, ooh, you know what would be cute? I've never used these stickers before. Maybe this would be cute. I wish she was pregnant. It just because that's not what I'm gonna be looking like. Um, I don't know what to do for the baby shower. Um, I just don't have anything. I don't have any baby stickers, I don't think. Let me look in my leftovers one more time. Um, I got nothing. Maybe just like an excited sticker from Once More With Love will work. Because I got nothing. Okay, so let's do that. Um, Once More With Love. And let's do this little yay sticker. Because we are very excited to meet her little boy. I put that on the totally the wrong date. That needs to be on the 28th. <laughs> Glad I caught that. Okay. There we go. Okay, and that is everything for this month. So it will definitely fill up because like I wanna go to the movie and I think
think we are, I don't know if I'm going to write it on here. I guess I could lift it up and stuff. I'll go ahead and write it. Um, I do want to maybe put like a blonde girl on there. I need like a cute blonde girl to represent Elle Woods. I don't see anything on here. Um, all of my Fox and Pip girls are definitely with brown hair. Um, what else? Leftovers, maybe? <laughs> I just don't have anything with blonde hair. Ooh, I think I know what I could use. Hold on. Got some of these from Scribble Prince Co. Let me see if I have fall ones. Um, how about this? She's got a coffee, I think. Yeah, that'll work. Put that there. Okay, so I think that is everything. Definitely will fill up, but these are what I know are going on. So let me go ahead and fill this out real quick, and I'll be back to show you the spread all pre-planned. So here is my pre-planning all finished up. As the month goes on, I will add more of my washi and I will fill in things that happened just like I did in August. Here is August one more time. And then I'll give you another example with June. So I fill in spaces with washi and add in events that happened. So I love a nice full monthly spread look and I think this is one this one is going to turn out just adorable I have lots of boxes left tons of stuff left on these two pages to use and um, I also have this one strip here that I could use as washi and I've got some flags so I've got plenty left to use for the rest of the month and I will definitely post pictures of my finished spread over on Instagram and I will preview it no I will show it to you when I preview my next month's spread when I do the monthly plan with me. So that is everything for this plan with me. All the shops will be listed down in the description along with any codes that I may have. And if you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already subscribed to my channel. And I'll see you next time. Bye!